get by. It resides between my eyes. Walk through the fire, came out better on the other side. See, life's like a peach if you find the sand. And right now, I'm feeling like a hundred grand. You are listening to Inspired Insider with your host, Dr. Jeremy Wise. Dr. Jeremy Weiss here with InspiredInsider.com, where I talk and interview top entrepreneurs and founders. We're here with Joel, founder of Eye for Fraud. And, you know, Joel, this is your fifth year at IRC, right? You guys, oh, fourth year. So tell me a little bit about why did you start Eye for Fraud? Uh, Basically, uh, Eye for Fraud start uh, because uh, they're... With a, we have a merchant company, a high-tech merchant, for a number of years, since 2004. A lot of clients were always complaining that the fraud is just increasing. In the online. You're a merchant company. Well, at the time, we are a merchant company. The merchant company is still uh, being run independently as a merchant company, but that's how we started yeah. because the people were complaining that the fraud is increasing and they had an issue. So we built a software... The company is called Eye for Fraud, and we are basically increasing sales and by preventing fraud from the first place of happening, and then by lowering the fraud and increasing the potential good sales. So tell me, so a customer comes on, tell me one of the big success stories of a customer's like, I am having issues with, they have issues with chargebacks, or what are their biggest problems? Well, uh, there's a lot of problems. We have a uh, client called uh, Interworld Highway. And they reached out to us that they had, uh, in one month, they had over $70,000 chargebacks in international. And they had a huge uh, team that they used uh, verification. And with all that... Even with the verification. Even with the verification, they had such a loss. So by hiring IFA fraud, they eliminate the verification from in-house. And they're only focusing on sales. All they have to worry now is, is sales. If it's a fraud chargeback, we guarantee them the money. And they so they were basically taking all these resources and personnel into this thing they're not even specialized in with chargebacks and diverting from their sales. And that's where you come in. That's correct. And now they're focusing only on sales. And we coming in, we do all their orders, and we're preventing the fraud from happening from the first place. And then we also guaranteeing them so this way they can increase the sales, and they actually increase the sales by over 40%. So with the merchant company, you were hearing this pain from your customers of these chargebacks, and that's why you started Eye for Fraud. What made you decide to, to, you know, you have to spend a lot of time, energy, money, effort to do this. This does not seem like an easy solution. What kind of things did you do to start the company? Um, as far as this, you know, a lot of software development, right? That is correct, and we got together with a few uh, partnerships, and uh, we just uh, built the software, which is uh, the best out of out there. And uh, by the software that we have, we guarantee that you will have almost zero fraud, and you will be able to increase your sales with a significant amount. What are some of the, Joe? What are some of the biggest causes of fraud? You probably see all sorts of reasons out there. What are some of the big ones? Well, these fraudsters out there, they'll try to trick you with all with all kinds of tricks to make this uh, fraudulent uh, transaction happen. Yeah. And we were seeing all kinds out there, even though some people think that when building a shipping address matches, that it's not a fraud. But that, this is not the case. Yeah. They will try to hammer you whatever they can. Like what, what are some of the insider tricks that these people are trying to defraud people? What, what do they do? Well, they do all kinds. They do all kinds of tricks. Uh, they will, uh, some people will try to do a order and they'll make sure that the package should arrive to a legitimately place and away the package. So this way they get a repeat customer and then they'll order a few times and then they will hit the merchant bad. So that's just the one, one uh, out of many, many others that they do. Yeah. So what's been one of the proudest moments for you, proudest times in you know, the company? Uh, well, the, the, the you know, seeing a uh, merchant coming in and almost going out of business because really? of fraud, and we just save them 
by eliminating the fraud with a significant amount and then help them increase their sales. So that's a good feeling to see a uh, merchants coming in and they're just bleeding and we stop their bleed. Yeah, you stop the bleeding. So how long does it take? So someone's like, I am, you know, Joe, I'm bleeding. How long does it take from when they come on board with you to stop the bleeding? I know it's different in all cases, but what would be like one example? Well, the bleeding stops right away. It does. But it takes, it takes time till the bleeding, uh, till, it, till it heats, uh, heals. Uh, the bleeding can stop right away, but it will take a couple of months to make sure to chase the frosters away, not only in front of your door, but we have to chase them out of the block and out of the city. Yeah, and you've been doing this a long time. What's one big lesson that we could leave with e-commerce founders out there that they uh, should be doing to help with their, their growth? Well, they need to have a fraud prevention. That's uh, the bottom line because when someone has it in-house, the, the first of all, you need a software like us to be able to prevent the fraud. And then the timing that you're putting in and you end up shipping and having a fraud chargeback is very frustrating. So by having eye for fraud, you'll be able to eliminate that all. You'll be able to increase your sales and prevent fraud from happening. What are some of the companies you integrate with? Because that's probably a question you get a lot. Do you integrate with this shopping cart or this solution? What are some examples of companies you integrate with so that you can prevent the fraud? We integrate with all major platforms out there like Magenta or uh, BigCommerce, Yahoo, and uh, open source. We also integrate with a lot of payment gateways like Authorize.net, USA ePay. So we work with almost everyone. From IRCE in Chicago, thank you, Joel. Where should people go to find you on the web? Well, our website is i4, the number four, fraud.com. So you can see all the information over there and all our API documentation. All right, hails from Brooklyn, New York. Thanks, Joel. Like a peach if you find the same right now I'm feeling like a hundred grand